In the IC rounds today, we were handling one case of uh, intra-abdominal infection. Uh, I asked the resident to add injection cholestine. He searched and within few minutes he was getting tensed up because uh, the up-to-date or med scale whichever app we were using, the dose was given as milligram per kg. But the injection formulation which was available in IC was given as international unit. Not only he, many nephrology residents and even in uh, pulmonology units, intensive care units, many confusion prevails with respect to the unit conversion of cholesterol and the dosage. So that we will see in this video. This was the formulation which was available in ICU. You can see cholesterol methate sodium 2 million international unit. You can see the details. Only it is given as international unit. Nowhere you will see milligram. Here also only the basic detail, no other unit conversion. If we open it, we will have the vial along with one info sheet. The, in the international unit system being followed in Europe areas and the milligram system being followed in the USA areas. That is that why, is why there in is the a difference. it was given as 2.5 milligram per kg. So in the vial also, you can see the powdered form. Only the basic detail of 2 million international unit is given, no unit conversion. So to have the dose adjustment for the patient, you should be aware of this dose conversion which is cholestin, cholestin methate sodium and cholestin base activity. 1 million international unit of cholestin equal to 34 milligram of cholestin base activity. In the up to date or med scam they have given the dose for cholestin base activity 2.5 milligram per kg of cholestin base activity this conversion you have to be aware otherwise if you want to know 1 milligram of cholestin base activity if you want to know 1 milligram of cba is equal to 30000 international unit of cms that that is how i have to calculate the dose In the up-to-date is mentioned don't use more than 5 mg per kg. That indirectly indicates don't use more than 10 million international unit per day. This cholestin belongs to polymyxin E group of antibiotics. Mainly used for gram-negative resistant organisms. Yes, this causes renal dysfunction or it is nephrotoxic. Dose modification is clearly not established. That is why... The students get confused by looking at various sources. So this is one standard dose adjustment. But final dose adjustment will be a clinical decision between the patient risk of infection and risk of AKI. Loading dose whether to give or not depends on the risk of infection versus risk of adverse event. For this particular uh, cholestin which I opened in the video, in the info sheet this is what given, how to give it. As the GEGFR comes down, how much million unit can be given? So it varies from case to case. On an average, the unit conversion and the EGFR based dose reduction I have mentioned over here. Few more details if the patient is on dialysis, the drug have to be given after dialysis. And the vial is available in formulations of 1 million unit, 2 million unit and up to 4 million unit also. It varies from institute to 